to another video. I can't believe it's so blooming close to Christmas. Karen has made these beautiful decals. I couldn't think what they were called then. So like, these are celebration decals, but these are going to be perfect for New Year. And she's just released a new glitter called Mesmerize. There are some others. Um, I don't know why I didn't show them in this video because I'm a plunker. But I'll put, hang on, I'll put images up. Hang on, in a minute. Right, I'm using um, Perfect White and Perfect Black from uh, Madame Glam. Right, the other glitters are... Um, hang on, I've got one here. It's called Luster, right? So there's Luster. There's Mesmerized, which I've just shown you. The stars I'm going to show you. And there is a gorgeous... Oh, it's like a new Mylar. Um, but I can't think what the colour of it is, but it's amazing. Um, so those are all new and they're on the website right now. Maybe I showed you in a different video. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Anyway, right, so we've got Madame Glam's Perfect Black and Perfect White. You can get 30% off any Madame Glam gel polishes using my code NATMUG30. Treat yourself for Christmas, because why not? Uh, right, I've cut out these two decals. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut as close to the decals as I can so that I don't have lots of excess, you know, decally stuff i don't know what it's called uh, and then i am going to put it on my stamper upside down i don't know that it matters which way yeah i don't know we're putting it on this way so that we can slide the backing off okay so what we're going to do is we're going to place it on our stamper which i've said about four times and then just using an old brush i'm putting a little bit of water onto the back of the decal and then eventually it should just slide off it doesn't take long matter of seconds like maybe 30, no, 20 seconds, I reckon. Um, and now it's on your stamper and you can place it wherever you want. I need to change my stampers because this one's got loads of glitter in it and it's difficult to see where I'm putting the, the decal. <laughs> uh, so it takes me ages to put it on. Look, I'm like, is that right? Is that in the right place? Is it, is it, is it? And then in the end, I just do that and then it's not quite in the right place, but it's okay. I could deal with it. It's like, I can live with it. But I love it. And these, these decals aren't just good for New Year. You can use them for other celebrations, you know, like birthdays, wedding, and other. I don't know, anything you want, anything you want. Look, you can use them for anything. I love them so much. But because it's New Year, we're going to use the clock as well. So again, I'm going to pop it on the back of my decal, uh, my stamper, put some water on it, wait for it to soak in, and then the back end will slide off. This one, I make it slightly, it's leaning slightly to the left. Um... And I only know that because when I go to put the crystals on, it's not quite straight. But it doesn't, it's not the end of the world. Right, these, we're going to go over with our velvet matte top coat. The velvet matte top coat is one of my favourite matte top coats of all time from Madame Glam. If you don't use their colours, at least try their top matte top coat because it's blooming gorgeous. Okay, so they're going to go in the lamp for 30 seconds. And that's, yeah, look, how nice they look already. You could just have them like that. I really like them. Right, look, these are all the other bits from Nail Sugar I'm going to show you. The uh, the stars, I want to put on the nail with some base coat. So I'm putting a really thin coat of base coat onto the nail because I don't want the nail to get bulky. But we're going to put the, I think they're called blush stars, but they're gorgeous. Look at them. They're like, oh, I just love them. They're hollow and they're lovely. And I do commit a cardinal sin at the end of the video. I'm not gonna say anything. I'm gonna see if anyone notices what I've done. I think you know what I'm gonna say, but I'm not gonna say it. You've got to guess. Uh, right, so what I'm doing is on this nail, I want a full nail of stars, but I'm leaving a gap between them. And you'll see some of the stars are pink. Some of them are like rose goldy, but and they're like different sizes. You get small ones and slightly bigger ones, but I love them. I think they're I think they're amazing. Uh, right, and we're going to go over with the matte top coat. No, we're not. We're going over with the the no white top coat. Um, no, hang on. Listen, right, that's in the lamp. While that's in the lamp, this nail we're going over with some no white top coat. I think this is the nail we're going to sugar. Yes, it is. So don't cure your top coat. This is mesmerized. This just goes really nicely with this set. I think that this glitter and the decals are like a perfect match. They're like a match made in heaven. So you need both. If you get one, you've got to get the other. It's just one of those things I've made up. Right, that's going to go in the lamp now. I'm going to double cure that because I've sugared it just to make sure it's fully cured underneath. And then we're going to use the no wipe top coat on these two nails. But 
They might not be shiny later. You'll see what I mean. I think you would have seen what I mean from the thumbnail, the picture on the thumbnail, but... <gasps> yeah, I might top coat it. Oh, God, I do. But I tell you what, I don't regret it at all. And I'm happily go to prison because... I think they look amazing matte top coated as well <laughs> right anyway this is the perfect nails glue gel this is uh, so normally i'd use the nailcomy crystal totalist gem glue but the gem glue from nailcomy is a lot thicker than this one and because i'm not doing the the crystal totalist gem glue is good for like clusters and stuff because it doesn't move or anything and um, but because um i'm only using flat backs today i'm going to use the perfect nails so these are preciosa clear crystals and Preciosa Aurum crystals. Aurum are uh, a quite goldy colour. I actually really like them. I'm glad I got some. I didn't get any. I, I hadn't, didn't, start again. I hadn't, Aurum was one of the coloured crystals that I got like quite recently. Um, I've had Starlight Gold and Capri Gold for a long time, but there is a place for Aurum crystal, for the gold. The Yeah, it's really nice. Anyway, I'm using my gel glue um as a guide to where i want my crystals so i'm kind of doing like um an arch do you see what i mean I, I put an arch down towards the clock and i kind of want it to look almost like it's sort of hanging from the crystals but not really and i'm going to put some crystals on the like three o'clock nine o'clock and six o'clock just to follow on the crystal theme so I'm going to speed this bit up and uh, and you can just watch me putting some crystals on. But I'm kind of alternating between the Aurum and the clear crystals. There we go. Now I decided that I need some caviar beads. So I'm going to use these gold caviar beads from Crystal Parade. Um, you can get 5% off using my code NAP5. And I'm just going to place these in any gaps that I feel like need need sort of filling up. But are perhaps too small for um, some crystals. Do you, you know what I mean? Um, and then I'm just going to place uh, an Aurum crystal at the bottom at 6 o'clock. And then I'm going to put three little, three little caviar beads um, in a little triangle here just to finish the the design so i tried to make it look as straight as possible because the clock was slightly wonky <laughs> i think it looked all right in the end but that's going to now go into the lamp for a 60 second cure and look i matte top coated the stars but don't they look gorgeous i really like them you can get 10 percent off nail sugar by the way using my code nat mug 10 all the links and and discount codes will be in the description box though anyway i hope you like this video if you did please leave me a like if you haven't already do consider subscribing and i will see you beautiful lot on wednesday for it it's not actually a nail video it's a slightly different video but yeah i hope you like it all the same anyway yep yeah, i'll see you in the next one love you all Bye.